And welcome back everyone, it's me, the Mad Hatter. Welcome back to Time Out Gaming with Assassin's Creed Syndicate. Uh, just to show you guys, I've been kind of busy. A lot. I haven't taken out the gang war, the, the final, you know, when we face the gang leader of the town. But I've also been busy going around town collecting a few of these things called Secrets of London. And apparently it's supposed to be the thing that's supposed to, um, give you the secret to, uh, the secret outfit that my friend told me about. Hmm. So let's see where this place leads. What goodies can be hidden in here? Mm-hmm. Alright, hold on. <laughs> Sorry about that. Pressed the wrong button. Alright. Oh, what the? What's in here? This is... My God, this is Michel Rouge's vault. <gasps> Michael Rouge's vault? It can't be. You have no idea who that is, do you? Probably not. The foggiest. He was an assassin. Father had one of his books. Legend says he found some fabulous treasure near Bath that drove him mad. He locked it away beneath London, in a vault that could only be opened by a set of special musical boxes. Special musical boxes? Now who's mad? Oh yeah, those are the things we've been collecting all around the city. Hmm. Yeah, these are all the things that I found from everywhere. Oh wait, hold on. It looks like this actually says something. Let's 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 at least read this real quick, everybody. Okay, Aiden. I wanna probably not read it out loud, but everyone else can read it. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, someone of them was definitely driven mad. So it's looking like he was actually talking to the first civilization peoples because they were named after the Greek gods, at least. Uh-huh. <laughs> Someone was having a little bit of drinky drink. Mm hmm? Someone riding the white tiger? Who is this Tom person anyway? Alright. <laughs> just, I like how it just written slut. <laughs> All right. Oh, excuse me. Uh huh. Right. Well, he definitely had a lot of right about. Wait, what? Did I just say children's thighs? Well, someone would have been on a watch list. Alrighty then. Well, that was interesting. So, we've collected them all. So now we just have to insert them and see what happens. Alright. Now 
Nice. I wonder if they like each play a certain type of melody that helps unlock the, I guess, outfit or the vault. Huh. They kind of like the same tune, but in different melodies or tones or frequencies. Or it is different songs. Huh. A lot of intricate work went in here. I'm surprised no one's come down here to do this. Well, maybe they have is just the assassins or whatever people that are left are keeping it away. Either way. Oh, hey, look. I'm on camera now. I had only four more to go. Wonder what I'm gonna be getting in here. Hopefully something good. Alright. Here goes the top layer. Whatever it is, it looks shiny. Sorry if this is like, you know, not as uh, as cool. As I was, but it is as pretty cool as I was hoping. I'm just, you know, it's just me going in listening to bedtime or lullabies, basically. I don't know what the hell I'm saying. I don't know. A lot of crazy things has happened over me through, uh, through the week of Halloween. I'm pretty sure everyone else had some strange weeks, too. I just had a little bit more because of... Yes, you! You know what I'm talking about. Don't you giggle in the background over there. You better come over here and explain yourself. No? Yes, well, I thought. Go back upstairs. That was Elizabeth over there just left, laughing her ass off and the other two were probably upstairs just giggling as well. Yeah, strange story. I'll probably have to tell that at another time. Alright, here we go. We get our costume or our new armor set. Wow, that does look pretty. Wait, why, why does that look familiar? Huh. looks like well, I suppose they've got another suit back there do you that one looks a bit tight for me and you would look a right tit in it <laughs> right tit in it wow I did not know I would get that much money I mean not much money I mean experience for that godlike I guess what is this? Alright. Oh, Minerva! The one! Ah, interesting. I can tell. Wow. So, melee damage, range, and cane sword damage even more. If I get a little bit more money, I can upgrade it. What's it do? Ah, even better. Nice. wonder what these other ones will be, but this one... Awesome. And let's see what she looks like. Ah. Cool. It even gives that, like, um... That holographic image... <laughs> effect awesome all right then um well let's see well let's test out this outfit let's go uh fight her so let's uh fast travel real quick and then test out this new outfit goody goody gumdrops everybody we brought Dust or garbage to huge sorting heaps while hill women? Huh. That's an interesting term. Hill women. I don't know, just a joke pop up in my head like an old uh, show, sexist chauvinist joke is what do you call a pregnant woman? Or we know it wasn't. It was uh, how many brain cells does a pregnant woman have? Two. And I'm just sitting there going, why? Why is that a thing? 
Also, I don't know how to date this, but I remember re- uh, someone told me a whole bunch of weird like, you know, the 1700s or the 1900s or whatever the hell it was. It was pretty weird. Oh, I'm up here again. Last time I was up here, this cricket killed me. All right, uh, there she is. All right, bloody Nora. Last time you almost killed me. Time for payback. Whee! Oh, wait, I think it went the wrong way. God damn it. So far, this thing's looking pretty snazzy. Wonder if the um, leap year thing would work in here. I think, or what is it? Is it Labor Day? There's supposed to be something that says that you're not supposed to wear white after Labor Day, I think is what it is. Either way, I just still think it's kind of interesting the, you know, the holographic effect the outfit has on when she's wearing it. It kind of looks like it's a glitch in the game, but I hope it's not. But it does look pretty. Wait, hold on. Does she have, like... Oh, for a second, that, yeah, it does look like she's got those, um... Uh... Oh, crap, all of what the... the, the, the Elizabeth, what the hell are those things called again? Oh, yeah, the, uh, the, the heel boots. Heel boots. Never mind, don't come back down here. Yeah, today I'm recording at my house right now. Hence, for a lot of things. I think you've been recording for a while. I think you have, too. You just forgot. I forgot about a lot of things. Shh! Quiet! Alright, sorry. Here we go. Whee! Sorry for being a little bit crazy. I'm always crazy. Alright, a little more interesting. Swan dive! Whee! Oh! Um. Wow. You were in the wrong neighborhood, bub. Alright, man, you are everywhere. Alright, let's see what she's got in store for us. Paybacks, bitch. Won't see this coming. Pretty interesting if I could turn invisible. Wait, there is an upgrade for that, isn't there? Yes, but we can't get that because of something else. I'm still trying to figure out what these pieces of eating things are for. I mean, it's supposed to be the shroud thing, but... London's so-called bloody Nora has challenged you to a gang war. All weapons permitted. Good luck to both sides. Alright. Let's see how this outfit works. Apparently she likes guns. Alright, here we go. Oh, I didn't notice you in the background. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, you wish. Yep, and here we go. Oh, that, oh, that looks like that could have ended badly. Oh, man, is all my people dead? All my people are dead. Wow, okay, well, this isn't going to end well for me then. Nope. <laughs> oh. This may be too high of a level for my um my own gang. Oh that looked like that her <laughs> oh. Yeah, I turned around I was like everyone let's oh shit, you're all dead. Fuck. Alright, let's see if I could uh I know there was an upgrade to help, you know, boost up my gang's um Level. Let's see if I can do that real quick, cause I'm pretty sure I need to, cause I can only you know fight against them myself for so long. Oh, okay, gotta think of a strategy here. You know, if we have to, we have guns. Guns will work. Yes. Wait, wait what? That's well, that's an interesting tale. Okay then, well let's uh, do a little upgrading since you know I do have four different skills. I'm pretty sure I can, um, I gang upgrades. Oop, wrong one. Ah, uh, I need 8,000, but I do need that. So, alright, I will jump skip ahead just so no one has to see this. Be right back. Alright people, and we're back for a rematch. I've upgraded my people, they're a lot stronger, and so am I. Yeah, you guys are fucked now! 
Yeah, not so helpless anymore. Oh, random civilian. You're in the wrong part of the town, Barb. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Oh, we got your attention now, do we? Guess what? Just because I wanted to. Since that's when what happened when you with ouch. So a while ago you shot me pretty well. Yeah, if you had some. Oh. You know what? I'm gonna execute you. Just because I can. You know why? Because I said so. I win! This town is mine. Get your own. Woohoo! Well worth it. Ladies and gentlemen, we are Evie and Jacob Fry. And as of this moment, you all work for us. Especially with that outfit she's got on. That really describes you better do what she says. Nifty! Oh, what's going on? New sequence? What does that mean? Uh, don't know what that's supposed to mean. But... I don't know, I'm trying to think. Should we do that, or should we go on to finish up with, uh... The origins of the syrup. You know what, since this thing popped up, let's check this thing out real quick. See what's got to have, what happened, and then we'll go to the syrup one for the next part if we can finish this in time. I'm just a wee bit curious about this. What's really going to be funny is that when I start building up my gang to be higher level than I am... They're going to be like, why are we paying attention to her? Shh, she could kill us in our sleep. All right, here we go. So, what's going to happen now? Seems a letter has come for Jacob. Really? How so? Okay. Um, is that for this? True, true. What's she talking about? Letter. What letter? I don't know what they're talking about here. Yeah, you too. Okay, it must be something to do with this then. Okay, the sequence four. There's that. And the sequence eight. Alright, let's check this one out real quick. A dinner invitation. Oh. And with whom are you dining this evening? Maxwell Roth. The leader of the Blighters. You're not going. Of course not. <laughs> of course not, dear sister. Do not worry about it. Just walks away. Oh, okay. Well, uh, that's a little high. Let's, uh, yeah, let's go with the surf first. That way we can at least, you know, get him ready to go for that. Okay. At least wanted to figure out what the hell was going on with that. After we do this thing, and then I keep going back and forth, back and forth, I thought that was going to be the start of a mission, but no, apparently that's just telling me that the gang leader for the Blinders wants to have a little chat. Well, we'll sit down a little bit later, but first let me uh, come and say that the cough syrup is rubbish, and we pour it down your throat. You know, stab it and choke on it. How about that? That's how they play. Whoop! Da 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 Shwing! Really wish I could start using weapons here, you know, or as I said before, uh, practice. Uh, keep game gets better and better. All right, best switch over the Jacob. Yeah. Oh, wait, before we do anything. 
Forgot he also has skills. And he needs to get up on that. Yep, execute two. He can take less damage because he's a tank, basically. Uh, let's see. I got four more. What's, what would be good? Uh, what's this? No, I don't need that. Uh, something. What's Jacob going to be good with? Yeah, might as well do that. Have that unlocked so he can do automatic headshots. Why, thank you. Now I'm at level 7. And... He might as well be a little bit stealthier. Even though he's not really fond of it, but he can be. Alright, so where is uh, Darwin? Ah, he's over here. Alright, so we're supposed to go to the, the, the funny farm. Oh, thief, huh? Well, this is your not so man. You are fat. You weren't going anywhere anytime soon. All right. So let's see how impenetrable this fortress for the padded rooms are. These two are having... Okay, you know what? Screw you guys. That's what you get. Leave me alone. I'm listening. Alright. I think we've heard enough of these two squabble. Let's intervene and actually get some things done. I have told you before, sir. I had nothing to do with that anonymous article. Nothing, I say. That is a lie, sir. And you know it. Bah, I don't have time for this nonsense. Nonsense? It is my name and reputation you have willfully besmirched, sir. My very name. Bah! <laughs> drive, damn you, drive. Oh, come on. Oh, well, hey, that's something. That is Richard Owen. A vile, despicable wretch of a man. Really? I could have sworn you were close friends. Mr. Owen works at the asylum. He will know who made the syrup. Get him. Oh, why didn't you just say it in the first place? Alright. Sorry! I'll bring it back. I promise. Not. Alright. Uh oh Whoa there. Hey, friend. How's it going? So. How you been? Uh, no. How about you tell me? None at all? Alright, how about this? No, I don't think so. I agree! Let's find out! Hey friends, how's it going? Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Excuse me, coming through! Causing as much mayhem as I can! Oh, oh, sorry, sorry! It's the guy inside, he's paying me to do this! Oops, I think I just crushed a kid. Didn't mean to. Oops, sorry. What about generic soothing syrup? Oh, yeah, some syrup. Soothing syrup? Why would a scientist have any interest in Oh, I don't know. You tell me. Next stop, the River Thames. Better speak now, old man. Oh, yeah, before I dunk you in the river. Speak, or should I have ever told your tongue? Maybe. Now, was that so hard? Yes. <laughs> At least he's honest. Well, that was quick. Didn't think it was going to be that easy. 
Wait, is he still in the... Oh. Can I get him? Can I get him out? Oh. Damn it. Oh, well. Better run. Alright, so... Alright, then there's the overdose. Might as well go over there. Actually, you know what? I'm just gonna have you more for a ride. Might as well. I was gonna do a fast travel, but might as well just make this guy's life even more of a living hell than it already is. Oh, watch out! Well, you don't have to worry about anything ever again. Oops, sorry. Man, this thing can take a beating. Oh boy, oh boy! I really gotta learn how to do that, those drifts that apparently defy the laws of physics for this thing. Oh, I almost ran over a kid. Alright. Almost there. Almost there. Giddy up, I know you're almost dead. We'll use you for meat later. Have a nice trip! Bye! Are you mining right now? Or you were just on drugs? You thinking about drugs? Me too! Alright. Let's end the madness. Or make more of it. I don't know, which one should we do? I see more. No, 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 we had too much of that. <laughs> there you go. I trust that you had a productive meeting with Mr. Oh, productive oh, indeed. Yes, we had the most wonderful chat. I found out the man behind Starrick's soothing syrup is John Elliotson. Dr. Elliotson, I haven't heard that name in a long while. He was a brilliant heart specialist until he became obsessed with phrenology and mesmerism. It ruined his career. Well, well, apparently he did something for it. How shall we proceed? Oh, with all respect, Mr. Darwin, I believe I should proceed alone. After all, we wouldn't want to attract any unwanted attention. Sounds very wise. Good luck, my boy. <laughs> I'll meet you again there. Oh, and uh, Mr. Fry, should you find yourself with any free time, please do call on me. Oh, I will, because you have some interesting side missions I've heard. All right, so uh, let's see what we can do here. Can we free the madmen? Can we let the, the crazy people in? You know, run the place. Well, okay, well, at least some, I have some of my crew here. So I don't have to worry so much about them. Or about what could go wrong. A lot of things could go wrong still. Oh, whoops. Uh, what? No, wrong vantage point. You went a little bit too high. Alright, vantage point. There it is. Whee! Oh, where am I heading? I did not see that. I was wondering what was going on. Is there a hole here? No, oh, it looks like there's. I'm supposed to go inside. Okay, well, there's an entry point right here. So, I might as well use it. Wait, someone's singing? Alright, enter. Go on. Hey, get, get. Jacob, get in the door. Where would I find the doctor? I don't know, Doctor Who? Interesting question. Maybe we should be in the skies. Alright. Are we gonna watch in on an operation? Oh, we are! Why is there a bloody handprint there? Um. Why isn't he strapped all the way down? Oh, damn! You're just drilling in his head! Okay. As you've just witnessed, the application of too much pressure can sometimes result in unexpected outcomes. Unfortunately, it appears I've ruined the organ. D okay. But Send up a cadaver. At once, Dr. Linson. Uh... Well, uh, I guess they're just using this place to do whatever experiments they want. I don't care about your ethics, and I care even less about your damn patience. Now hand over your keys. What are you doing? Haven't you heard? You're fired. 
Now bugger off. Well, this is all intriguing. Trying to let the evil spirits out of his head or something? Okay. So I need to find the nurse so I can infiltrate and then I need to kill the young doctor. Alright. How to do it. Okay then. So I need to halt the electrocusive therapy and do not fire a single bullet. Okay, hold on. Alright. Talking to her probably would help me get the key or something. Can I get in? There we go. Hold on. Let's go in here. Enter. Enter. Jacob, you really need to learn how to get into windows. Alright. What have you got to say, young lady? Hello. You gonna do anything? Can I, like, low? Oh, okay, well, I got that, but... Alright, so what? Okay, yes, that's what I was trying to do, but you two wouldn't let me. What's the matter? Oh, young man, help. I must speak with Miss Nightingale at once. One of the brutes stole my key, and there's no one around. I can't get out of here. Stole your key. Don't go anywhere. I might be able to do something. Oh, quite. Thank you, sir. All right. So there he is. So either we need. Find me, sir. Oh, go on now, sir. I will wait here. Okay. So is there a way for me to sneak up somewhere on him? Yeah, I agree. He basically just drilled a hole into someone's head with no good reason whatsoever. Okay, really? Okay, there we go. I also need to make sure I go and kill the young doctor, wherever the hell he is. Alright, uh... Yeah, I know I need to get him. That's easy. He's all the way in the basement. That's going to be another thing I have to worry about, but for later. Alright, here we go. Now, I wonder if I could just kill him and get the key, but I'm guessing I need to be more stealthy than that. Good thing we got that extra upgrade. Alright. Okay, here he comes. He could be, but he's about to be in a lot more trouble than he thinks. Alright. Okay. No, no intruder. Believe me, no intruder. Thank you. Sorry. You didn't hear or see anything. You know what, just because I feel like it, I will kill you. Thank you, have a nice day. Alright, now I need to figure out a way. Yeah, best uh, get him away from everybody. So that way, no thing can go wrong. There we go. Alright, now I need to kill the other young doctor and also find a way to... Stop this electrotherapy thingy, Mubabra. Okay, so how do I go downstairs? I wonder why so few patients don't this. I don't know, but you can answer that another time. Dr. Elliot, he cannot be allowed to continue his experimentation. Oh, he won't. Alright, now do I continue talking to you? Oh yeah, we can free her now. Gratitude, sir. I shall inform Miss Nightingale that I'll not be working for this asylum ever again. I agree. I would leave as soon as possible. Alright, now identify him. 
Oh! Yes, indeed! I think I shall do that. Easy way to do. Alright. There's gotta be another way to... Is that where the electrotherapy thing we bought is going? Well, I got a key now, so I can unlock everything, I hopefully. That door won't open, though. Alright. Let me go to an entry point, though. This is awesome. I really do want to try to do that cadaver kill. I right, dress up as a cadaver. Awesome! Alright, here we go. And away we go. Alright. I still also... Go on, Jacob. There we go. I still want to try to see if I can turn off the electrocution, because I saw that guy being prodded and poked with that stuff. And trust me, electrocution therapy, not as healthy as some people believe. At least they've made advancements now. At least you can be knocked out. They didn't used to do that, though. Okay. Oh, no, I didn't trespass. Ah, crap. Well. Well, you guys deserve it, I'm pretty sure. Hopefully. Hopefully none of these guys are innocent. <laughs> Alright. So, where's the... I don't know if that's the electrocution thing or not. Gotta find where that thing is. I don't... I think that is, that's the only thing I can see. That, that, you know, that has the highlighted effect. Alright. Gonna kill you too. Okay, I guess that's where all the, um... People are going for their happy time, or at least their exercise. Still gotta find a way downstairs, though, so I could do that unique kill. I really want to get in a cadaver. Okay, um... Entry point. Okay, this is just another one of these. Okay, so there's gotta be another way. Okay, there's something I missed down here. Now that I can, you know, unlock all the doors, there's got to be something. Alright, come on. I really just go around in a circle. Alright, well, that's one guy down. Yep, without the key. I've heard that story. I heard it from the last people that I killed. Yep. Oh, your people are going away, good doctor. Okay, then. Alright, I think I'm getting close to... Where it is. Uh, nope. Guys, you didn't see anything, I swear. I'm a guest. I'm an honorary guest. Don't let anyone fool you. No, I don't. I just fight better. And thank you for playing. Have a nice day. Alright, I think that's where the electric therapy is, and I should be getting close to... Oh, come on! The door won't open! What about in here? Uh, you think with the master key I would be able to get where I need to go. Okay. Hmm. Alright. Can I go around? Ah, here we go. Here's a door that I can open. Oh, sorry, people. I don't mean to frighten you. I'll free you all! Freedom! Uh oh. Woo! One more shot me there, buddy. Okay, you get one. That's all you get. You get one. Okay. I was hoping that this was where the electrocution thing was going on. Where is the electrocution thing going on? Almost tempted to get my men to come in here and just beat the crap out of everybody. Oh, here it is. 
Hey guys, how's it going? I think my friend need a break. Alright. Now I need to find a way down stairs. Hey, nope, sorry. You don't call for backup for nothing. It's probably like mass murderers or crazy, really crazy people that I'm letting, like, you know, have no supervision right now. Alright. Well, sorry about that. Looks like I found the thing, everybody. It was right down right where the electrocution thing is. Alright. Alright, so I need to... I thought I was anonymous. Okay. Here we go. What do I do with it? Okay, I guess I just put it somewhere. Of course, you're gonna get in the way. Alright, here we go. Gonna hide the body in here. No one's gonna suspect a thing. Okay, you guys need to be quiet or I'll make sure that you won't talk ever. Oh, goody, 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 goody. I would be giggling so much under that sheet thinking that I can't believe this is actually going to work. Man, it looks like you've seen better days. Oh, I guess he was kicking away a rat or something? Oh, look at that smug look on your face. Oh, boy. Oh. Uh, two birds, one stone. Two birds, one stone. We will continue our experiment shortly. Uh-huh. In a moment, we will compare the brains of our two specimens. Yes. Since both specimens had a propensity towards violent behavior, we should see similar protrusions in specific parts of their brain. Like this! Well, science, everybody! What do you have to say for yourself? Yes, I can only think of beginning. Better tomorrow, forged with the blood of visionaries. Like yours? All I see is the blood of a lunatic. <laughs> Do you truly believe murdering an old man will stop humanity's great architect? Crawford's yeah. work has a glorious design for mankind. Oh, not for long. Designs are meant to be broken. Oh, you're a child. A child who believes it can solve all the world's woes with a flick of a blade. Have you ever pondered the consequences of your actions, Jacob Fry? Or did your father teach you nothing? Wonder how you knew that. Oh well, we'll find that out another time. Now I must collect your blood with the, the rest of the fallen, and then I must run away. Luckily for me, I have the master key and I can almost leave in instantly. -da 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 -da. Entry point. Oh, nope, never mind. This was the door that I had before. Never mind. That's the entry point right over there. Let's leave. 
Yeah, most of the people are dead now, so I don't have to worry about them chasing me. Lucky me! Alright, here we go. Too bad we can't fly or something. That would be most useful right about now and also very fun. Oh. Alright. We got the carriage. Carriage away! Excuse me, farming. I'll be firing this for a second. Bye! Yay! Awesome! Doing fine, girl. We finished sequence four. Elliot's an expatriate, and soothing syrup production has ceased. Outrageous! Fry intends to endanger all of London at the hands of the mob. Or perhaps it doesn't intend much of anything at all. Thank you. Simply content to dice with our lives. The asylum is shut up. Medical care throughout the city is in disarray. He does not, cannot understand the consequences of his actions. The man is clearly an anarchist. Gentlemen. This tea was brought to me from India. By a ship. And up from the harbor to a factory. Where it was packaged and ferried by carriage to my door. Unpacked in the larder and brought upstairs to me. And? All by men and women who work for me. Who are indebted to me. Crawford Starrick. For their jobs, the time, the very lives they lead. They will work in my factories and so too shall their children. And you come to me with talk of this Jacob Fry. This insignificant blemish who calls himself assassin. You disrespect the very city that works day and night so that we may drink this. This miracle, this tea. I'm nearing the end of my research. Our beloved London shall not suffer such a bothersome fool for much longer. Oh, you what think? sister I've heard of, Miss Fry. Miss Fry shall be gutted. Soon enough. Delicious. <laughs> oh. Sorry to interrupt in a ship. Thought you'd like to know that Sean and Rebecca got away from Otzelberg. Nice. Berg runs a unit called Sigma Team. Violet DaCosta is his tech support. They've been hunting and killing assassins for a long time. Yes, we've noticed since the last game. Looks like you oh, both did pretty good. Oh, tish tosh. It'll take more than a Templar super soldier to end the glorious saga of Sean Danger Hastings. <laughs> yeah. He's talking to Rebecca. Right. Anyway, Berg's presence confirms it. The Peace of Eden is in London. The Initiate's data sync suggests it's the Shroud. The Templars seem to want it pretty bad all of a sudden. They must know something we don't. The only thing we know is that we can't go up against Sigma Team alone. Leave that to me. In the meantime, keep a low profile. Let the Initiate continue to sync the data. Yeah. Oh, fire on us. Well, this episode's gone a little bit longer than I thought it would, but hey, that doesn't matter. It's always good content. Hopefully they'll, like, do an original series where you can, where the person that you play is, like, which was Desmond, you can actually run around and do stuff. Hopefully. I don't know. But next one is Sequence 5, and then we have 6, 7, and 8 supposed to be, like, what up? 2, 4, 6, 7 parter? Interesting. All right, everyone. So I think I'll end the episode on this note. It was awesome. I would love the little extra, you know, uh, I don't know, I guess, sequence that you can to kill the, um, the targets. I really thought that was a nice key. So I can't wait to see what happens next. Looks like things are really supposed to get kicking now. So thank you again for watching Time Out Gaming. I'm the Mad Hatter, and I'll see you guys again next time. Bye-bye.